Hey guys, it's Ro. Welcome to another Nerdy Nummies. Look, you guys, we have a special guest. It is Kurt. What up? You guys know Kurt. We baked together. Hmm. We hung out a lot. We ate some baby food on yeah. one video before. And ice cream mm -hmm. on that another. Was, that was a better time. So this is going to be perfect. Today we're going to be doing something ice cream themed. I got a lot of requests from you guys to make something Pokemon themed and it's summertime. So I thought let's make something related to ice cream. It is going to be the first time ever on Nerdy Nummies that we are going to be making a homemade ice cream waffle cone. Oh yeah. It's going to be so good you guys. And we're gonna be playing I Love Pokemon, a song Kurt made. Yeah. Yeah. I love this song. Who doesn't love Pokemon? I don't know. Be I do. Let's, Let's get, get started. started. The things you will need will be three fourths cup of all purpose flour, three fourths cup of powdered sugar, three to six tablespoons of water, it varies a little bit, three eggs, we're just gonna be using the egg whites, an additional two tablespoons of powdered sugar, but we're gonna be keeping this separate, I'll show you why later. Five tablespoons of butter, one teaspoon of vanilla extract, half a teaspoon of salt, and a pinch of nutmeg. And then to decorate, you're gonna need light cocoa and red candy melts. You will also need a pineapple, a waffle grill, a mandrill, aka waffle formation device, <laughs> and a little diamond cookie cutter. Now, now let's, let's put, put it, it all, all together. together. The first thing that we're gonna do is whisk together our dry ingredients in this bowl over here. Kurt, will you whisk for me? I've been practicing for this moment. Yes. I'm ready. Our powdered sugar, our flour, a little salt, and the nutmeg. You just whisk together till it's well combined. Now we're gonna make some meringue. First thing that we're gonna do is crack our eggs. We just want the egg whites. I'm gonna trust you, we can oh, do this. Man. I call it the jiggle method. It's the jiggle method. I don't know what it's actually like called, but we're gonna I'm, go for okay, it. I'm gonna watch you first, okay? Yeah. You let the egg whites fall out. Okay, okay. I didn't get a very big shell, but you just jiggle the yolk back and forth, and then we'll dump oh the yolk God, we over got a here. Huge blob of oh, yes. oh, here, here. You're doing good, Kurt. This is better than I usually do. Really? <laughs> I don't think that's true. I think you're just trying to make me feel better. Okay, well, okay. Little stuff happens. Now with your hand mixture, you're gonna whisk these up until they're a little frothy. Now we're gonna take the smaller measurement of powdered sugar, the two tablespoons, and I'm gonna lightly sprinkle it in while Kurt is mixing. And remember, you don't wanna make it rain. This is like making it drizzle, and with powdered sugar, it's kinda like snow, so it's like lightly snowing. And we're gonna whisk together until we have soft peaks. And that is what your soft peak should look like. Mm-hmm, right here. It's time to fold. Yeah, the first thing that we're gonna fold in is our dry ingredients. We're gonna fold it in in halves. I'm just nice. eyeballing it to fold, cut down the middle, scoop under, and turn. Once it's folded in, now add your remaining flour. Here you go. I'm ready. More folding. You keep folding. Yup. We melted our butter and let it cool, and now it's time to mix that and the vanilla in the bowl. Uh, Pour it in, Kurt. Right now on. I'm gonna be folding. Yeah, you got folding duties now. Yeah, we switched. Mm. Now you can just hang yeah, out. I'm gonna, I'm gonna there just, you go. Dance on the side. Yep. Everything is folded together, and now we are gonna add our water. We're gonna add three tablespoons, which is half of this. You may need to add more, but we're just gonna eyeball it. Let's see here. I'm ready to mix. There's about half. You I want the waffle batter to be a little bit more runny than it is now. We ended up adding about four tablespoons. Kurt's gonna show you what it should look like. It should be running about that quickly. Do the drip. We got our batter ready and we got our waffle cone maker heated mm -hmm. up, so. Open your waffle cone maker. We're gonna scoop in two scoops right mm. into the center. Oh, yes. Nice. And then another, another. one. Another. All right. Oh, yeah. And close it. I love the noises it makes. Then we wait about a minute. You can open it to check it to make sure it gets the brownness that you want. Looks good, we just need a little bit more color. Now you're gonna take a little spatula. That looks good. Get them out of there. And then with your fingers, I'm gonna start to roll the shape. Use the mandrel. I will use it's the mandrel. It's a little mandrel. warm, watch out. We don't push it all the way in because we don't want as wide of a cone and we're gonna hold it in place over the seam. Once you feel like it's gotten hard, mm -hmm. then you can take it off the little mandrel and voila, a waffle cone. Just set that right down there. Kurt, would you like to model this? Mm. It looks so oh, good. I'm ready to model it. 
Ta-da! Now you can make as many waffle cones as you like. I'm gonna make at least four because I'm gonna be making four themed Pokemon treats today. Now that our waffle cones are done, we're gonna make our decorations. Mm -hmm. Got a little candy melt and some pineapple right over here. Mm -hmm. And over here, I made this template in Photoshop. I'll put a link down below if you wanna use this template or you can make your own, whatever you'd like. I picked four Pokemon that I wanted to decorate and I just made their little face Faces. These are very, very simple. The eyes are shaped just a little bit different, but I wanted to make decoration really easy. So we've got Pikachu, Bulbasaur, Charmander, and Squirtle. I taped down the paper template onto a cutting board so I could move it around if I needed to, and then placed a piece of wax paper on top, and we're gonna tape it down. Tracing for the win. I've melted the candy melts. I put them into two plastic baggies, and we've got a number three tip at the end for a little bit more control. Now I'm just gonna trace out their eyeballs and mouth designs. And then with the red candy melts, he could choose cheeks. While I'm doing this, Kurt's gonna make some cute little Pika ears. Take our little cookie cutter and cut out the pineapple. And to cut our pineapple wedges in half. And we're just gonna dip the tips of the ears in some chocolate. Cutie. Let me see him on you. Yes! Up you go too. For our ice cream, we got a bunch of different flavors for the colors we wanted. I've got mint chocolate chip for Bulbasaur, and I've got orange sherbet for Charmander. And we got some lemon custard gelato for Pikachu, and some cotton candy for Squirtle. That's right. Now we're gonna take a big scoop, put it into our homemade waffle cones, and add our decorations. Yeah, I'm gonna get a big scoop. It's gonna be so cool. Oh, oh no, oh no, that oh, didn't happen. Oh. And then I'm just gonna place it here right on top. Just squish them in there. Then you're just gonna pick up your little candy melt decorations and place them onto your ice creams. Da -da! Da -da! Here are the Pokemon ice creams that we made today with our homemade waffle cones. A big thank you to you guys for suggesting something Pokemon and a big thank you to Kurt for helping me bake today. Thank you for having me again. Aww, as always, I love this guy. He's amazing. I'm gonna put all of his links down below. Go check him out and a link to his song, I Love Pokemon. And I'll be posting lots of pictures of our little ice creams on Facebook, Tumblr, Instagram, and Twitter. And if you guys make them, please take a picture and send them to me. Or if you have a favorite Pokemon that we did not make today, you should make an ice cream of that and send it to us. And if you have any other ideas for any other nerdy nummies, please let me know. Leave me a comment down below and I will do my best to make it happen. All right. Thanks again, you guys. Bye-bye. Bye -bye. Cheers. Cheers. Yeah. Mmm. 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 Mm. Charmander, your face tastes so good. I love Pokemon. Raise a glass of Moo Moo Milk for Pokemon.